what's up i'm triple shoot welcome back to another video in this quick guide i'll be showing you how to fix the steam must be running error that you could be getting when you're trying to fire up any steam game this is the new ui currently in beta so if things look a bit different you know why this guide is updated first of all if you're not already, try and launch games directly from your Steam client rather than shortcuts on your desktop, etc. Simply search for the game over here and double click on it or select it and click play and this will probably solve the issue as it's more than likely trying to start up in the wrong directory and not locating Steam properly. Should that not help, try rebooting your PC and relaunch the game to see if things are fixed. Assuming it's still not working, we can try checking for updates in Steam. In your Steam client, click Steam in the top left, then from the drop down, select Check for Steam Client Updates. When you do so, it'll launch the update checker, and assuming one is found, it'll then be downloaded and installed. Otherwise, we're all up to date. Now, something else you can try is either joining or leaving the Steam Client Beta. This won't affect your games, it'll only affect the Steam Client. Now, currently, this UI is in beta only, so disabling it will lose access to the new UI features until it rolls out fully. But of course, when this is fully rolled out, that won't be an issue for you. Simply click Steam in the top left, then from the drop down, select Settings. Previously, it was under the Account tab, but now it's under Interface. So select Interface here, then from Client Beta Participation, the second item on the list here, select either the Steam Beta Update if you're not on the beta, otherwise no beta chosen. Then after closing this, Steam should update and either download a newer version or an older stable version. Should things still not be working, let's try verifying game files. Right click the game in question, then choose properties. On the installed files tab, click verify integrity of game files. This will then run through all of the files for this game on your PC and make sure that they match the server exactly. Everything is the way that it should be. When it's done, try firing it up and things should work properly. Otherwise, if things are still not working, let's try run Steam as admin. Click Steam in the top left, then select Exit. When Steam is closed completely, locate your Steam icon wherever it may be, on your start bar, desktop, etc. Right click it, then from More, select Run as Administrator. Otherwise, run as Administrator under any of the drop downs that it may be for your current shortcut. We'll then need to click Yes when it prompts us about running as admin, and at this point, it should have much better access to the game files on your PC. If this fixes it, it could be an antivirus or other settings getting in the way of things working. Working properly. Anyways, that's about it for this quick guide. So thank you all for watching. My name's been Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.